Greetings there, slings. Tis I, Outfoxed, and I am the worst video gamer in the world. And you're watching Mike Daring's Minecraft Hardcore Challenge for June 2016, The Peacemaker. Michael Daring's Minecraft Hardcore Challenge is an open to the public challenge for a person or team of people attempt to complete an assigned objective on a given seed within a time limit. Eight or nine episodes. Challenges are attempted in hardcore mode on single player maps or server if you're a part of a team in a non head to head format. Each episode is one game day, uh, sun up to sun up. Progress is posted on Mondays and Fridays. As always, day one deaths do not count. After that, all bets are off. See Michael Daring's channel for a complete rules list. If you want to post videos, we ask that you contact PB Plays Inside to be on the official players list and keep an eye on Baker Bell Games YouTube channel for the announcement of each month's challenge. All right, so June 2016, hardcore mode. Seed for this month is 2151. Generate structures is on. World type is large biomes. And we're off. I don't see a village. Oh, there we go. There's a village. And I'm going to. Yeah. Render distance back up. Last month I turned it down because we were we were in a jungle. And I'm not sure why I'm gathering seeds. Though I'm not seeing trees, so we may have to go on an excursion and find trees. There's the second village over there. So this is uh, the Peacemaker. Uh, there are two villages. Village one. Village 2. Um, both are, are beset by zombie invasions and blame the other villagers. Or blame the other village. So, yes, I'm kind of, kind of uh, concerned about the lack of trees. Uh, so, you need to uh, secure both villages against zombie invasion. And then create a trade trade route between the. No, oh, right. Uh, there's trees. Uh, you need to create a trade route between the two cities to promote uh, community and love and compassion and all that stuff. So we're gonna run over to these trees real quick. Gather some uh, some wood. Reads over there. I'm going to grab them because they're available. Nothing immediately springs to mind. I, you know, I don't have any idea why I would need reeds. I'm going to make books from them, and uh, if we get lucky enough to to one of the um, one of the villages has a librarian, we can do some some trades for paper. Or already noon the first day, I, I really feel like I haven't gotten anything accomplished. And I mean, well, I haven't. I've run from there to here. Grab a little bit of wood. It'll get us started. We need, uh, well, the wood will get us started, and then it'll give us saplings to start a wood farm. Because we're going to need a bunch of wood.
one day I'll get that right. That's the red. It's a uh, bounce through a bunch of con uh, concepts for this month's challenge. And I thought about uh, um, doing kind of a red versus blue thing. Paint one village red and paint the other village blue. And I realized that, oh, there, hello. How you doing? Can you, can you just stay down there? Good. Not coming around or anything, are you? He is. <laughs> uh, that's five saplings. That should be plenty. I want to uh, distance myself from this creeper anyway. Need to pick up some cobble on the way back. There were numerous caves. So, yeah, no harming peaceful mobs. Oop, I, that was not a peaceful mob. And neither is that. Oh, that's not good. Not good. There is... Yeah, we're getting a little bit of lag here. Yeah, it cleans up. Um, yeah, there, there are... Well, monsters, anyway. I, I can't say a dungeon. And monsters spawning within uh, Stone's Throw of the village, of uh, First Village. See, the sun is still straight up. Okay, so not as bad as I, as I was thinking. couple of uh, a couple of out of the way uh, farm patches tell me that doesn't go down it does you go into a cavern you do oh that's fun and there's iron right right there and a skeleton. That's not fair. Yeah. So we get a skeleton right there.
Yeah, this will be interesting. We'll go down uh, a herd of skeleton down there. So, in all probability, got to face down at least a skeleton. Without the benefit of a shield. Oh, there's two. Um, let's see if we can get some iron without culling their attention. Culling their attention. Hmm. Without, without attracting their attention. There's a little bit of iron. Okay. Now. Oh, I want some shovels. That's because I'm going to be doing a lot of digging. Doggone. Right. They, uh, they forgot they uh, started underwriting these, uh, the gravel roads with cobblestone. I'm going to have to be quick as soon as the sun is actually down and there are mobs spawning. I have the chance of uh, getting a creeper to the head. Oh, come on. Try to board some of these. Oh, nice. Board up some windows so that zombies can't get in there. I don't have enough. Yeah, lighting. Oh, lighting. Will have minimal effect. Oh, come on, get in your house. Um, I can use lighting to prevent spawns, but uh. There's nothing to prevent spawns from just walking in anyway. Continue trying to secure the village. Keep getting distracted with uh, zombies. No oh, doggone.
Oh goodness, better. Um, Okay, I think I've secured enough of the village. <laughs> right, but I le left all my stuff outside. Great. Uh, Over there. Need to get some food going. Oh, and a witch. That's great. There we go. wood to make a crafting table. That's a bummer. Oh, good lord. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> there are just entirely too many zombies around to to risk going out. A couple of Endermen. Oh, I can see the other village from here. I hope they're not getting attacked. That could be bad. That could be very bad. Didn't realize I'd be able how close they are. Yeah, I want to go out and fight, but I have no armor and uh, no shield, just stone tools. And the uh, 1.9 updates got me doubting my combat skills, so that's just not a good time to, to, to be out playing with monsters. Well, I wish I had more wood. Oh, I saw that. Okay, he didn't see me though. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> yeah, skeleton on the far side of that tree. Skelly, skeleton. Tell me the okay. Kind of looks like uh, yeah. One one uh, zombie spawned inside the other rooms. <laughs> and 
sun's going down. Our sun's coming up, the moon's going down. Oh, oh, I got three of them. Okay, um, zombies are burning, so that's my... There we go. Uh, that's my cue. There's the end of the end of the episode. I thank you for watching and hope you have a great night. If you were entertained or educated at all, a thumbs up is always appreciated. Leave your questions, comments, and suggestions below. If you want to follow my series, feel free to subscribe.